Good morning, everybody. How are you? I'm trying to hold my, my camera and my phone at the same time. <laughs> um, it's, a nice, um, it's a nice Monday. The sun is shining. We've had some snow over the weekend. Not as much snow as, as they anticipated, I don't think. Um, but it was good. It's all gone now. It was like gone within like the next morning. It snowed at night. Started about, oh, I don't know, three in the afternoon. Then it's, it was on and off during the night. And then like seven o'clock the next morning, it started to taper off. It was like gone. So I hit the mall this weekend. Hope everybody was okay. Went to um, Primark. Whoops. <laughs> Went to Primark. Oh, let me just show you today. I'm cooking my um, um, some gravy. Usually I don't let everybody in on what I do, but I make my gravy. As a matter of fact, my gravy now needs a turn. I need a backsplash for uh, this wall. I don't know. I'm undecided on what I want to do yet. Let me just put you over here. And let me give my gravy a stir while I'm speaking to you. So like I said, went to the mall on the weekend. Um, the sales are just about tapering off. Um, everybody's a very big Bath and Body Works fan. I joined um, a Facebook page that I absolutely love. It's an unofficial page. So I kind of think the unofficial pages are a lot more fun than the actual official pages. There's, I don't know, too much, too many rules on an official page. I don't know, you can't do this, you can't do this, you can't do this, you can't do this, you can't make fun of it, you can't do, you know, I mean, if it, you, you're actually kind of afraid of, to say anything on these pages lately. Because everybody's too, uh, everybody takes it very personal. The making fun of each other, though, that I, that I don't stand for. That I won't stand for. So, let me just get this going at a reasonable, nice little, nice little simmer. And I will speak to you. So, I love that my mall has a Primark store. Like I said, let's stand it up here, people. I love how my... My mall has a Primark store, and not everybody has one. There is one in Brooklyn, and there is one in Staten Island. So, where I am is where I am. But my Primark store is nice, and they have great prices. Some of the sizes, for me anyway, because I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a woman, sometimes I take a size 10, sometimes I'm an 8, depending on the cut of... I'm looking for jeans, but those jeans are like on the more younger style. I love my skinny jeans, always did, okay? I'm 53 years old, okay? But I still love a nice pair of, of jeans. Um, they have them over there at Primark, the skinny jeans. They also have jeggings, which I love jeggings. Who doesn't love jeggings? They're easy to put on. They're easy to take off. They just, you just throw them on. They're easy. You don't need a belt, you know, things like this. So, um, they have leggings. Um, it's not a sale. I guess it's not a sale. I mean, I, I don't know if this is like regular prices or what, but they have leggings. I purchased two pairs of their leggings and I see that I take a medium, not a large in, in the leggings. Thank goodness. And I got a pair in black and a pair in blue. They're mediums. And you see the tag there for $3.50. Great pair of leggings, really. These are the blacks in medium. And they're the long length. They do have the shorter length. They have the bicycle length. They have the capris over there. I'm going to, as the weather gets warmer, I do need new, new things. So I'm going to be hitting Primark a lot. Just for those things. Um, uh, trips to Disney World. I'm going to need new shorts and everything. I can't wait to see the Summer Ensemble. That's at Primark. I can't wait. So I'm going to be doing that. And these are cotton regular length for $3.50. So a pair in black and a pair in blue. I usually buy, um, back in the 80s, my mother-in-law um, used to buy me and my her daughter, my sister-in-law, uh, Dan Skins. We used to love Dan Skins. Every, every uh, Christmas, we used to get in, like an outfit. And it used to be uh, two pairs or three pairs of leggings and a top. You know, maybe two tops. It was wonderful. She, she used to get us a pair of gray, a pair of blue, and a pair of black. We were set for like the, the whole 
like the whole winter and the whole summer. And, and I tell you, Dan skins, I mean, that's great material. They really last. Years ago, you used to pay maybe $20 to $25 for a pair. Now you're paying like $35 or $40 for the same pair of leggings. I did purchase two years ago. I went on the Dan Skin website because the original store where my mother-in-law used to get them was, is no longer available. But I went on Dan Skin. These things are like $35, $40. Okay, I bought, I bought three pairs. I couldn't get the blue pair, so I had to wind up going to a store in my old neighborhood in Queens. And they managed to have, I paid close to $40 just for that one pair. But did I want the gray pair, the black pair, and the blue pair? Yes, I did. Because it brought back a lot of memories. And I still have them. They, they last, Dan Skins last for years. They always did. Always. They never got linty. They never got, they never ripped. They never got thin in the butt. They never, they did, the material never thinned out. They were just wonderful. But anyway, these kind of remind me, to be honest, of the Dan Skins. Especially the blue. They seem to be very good, uh, strong material. And again, $3.50 for the blue. I know you can't really see it, but it is blue. So I got two of those. One and one. Eh. When the weather gets warmer, I can't wait because I, I love my leggings. They're so comfortable. And I, I also managed to pick up, they had fleece uh, pullovers. Now, when the fleece pullovers were over there a few weeks ago and like around Christmas, they were only $12. And I wanted the black and the black and red plaid. I wanted that. Who's bothering me? Oh, get away from me. I wanted the black and the red plaid, but they don't have it in my size. They had as much as a medium. Now, in the fleece tops, I actually like I like it to be big because if I wear a shirt underneath it, you know, just to wear. And sometimes if I go out, I just want to wear the fleece pullover. I don't want to even, I don't even want a jacket. So they now had the fleece pullovers on sale. Again, red and black are out of my size. But I managed because I love camouflage. They did have the camouflage. And I get the camouflage in an extra large. And the material is so soft. From a markdown from $12 down to 5 Five dollars. If they had any more in any other color, I would have grabbed them. I would have grabbed my husband one. I would have grabbed more for myself. But they only had the camouflage. So, I managed to get that. Let me see. And it's great. It's 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 awesome. Okay, and I got the extra large. It's nice because it has the high collar. I like the high collars because... In case I, I I have to protect my neck a lot. I don't I don't. When I go outside, I wear a, an infinity scarf. I wear something around my neck. I just don't like. But yet in the house or in a shirt, I gotta cut the necks off of my shirts. I just can't stand anything near my neck except when I'm outside. Then I protect it. So this is the camouflage, and it was twelve dollars. But like I said, I know it's backwards. Like I said, I got it for five. Okay, this is called Primark Cares. And it's a, it's a great color. It really is. I love my camouflage. So really, that was it. When it's Bath and Body Works, like I said, they still have it at 75, 50 cent sale going on. They have the new flavor of um, coming out. It's not out yet. Strawberry pound cake. Now, <laughs> the board is like buzzing with this from the Facebook board, the unofficial page. And the girl, I discussed it with the girl yesterday that's over there, and they did have the candles. I took a whiff of the candles. First of all, I'm not really crazy about the candles. I like my wax melts. For those who watch my videos, you know I like wax melts. I don't really, there's something about fire in my new, my new house. I really don't want to, <laughs> I just don't like candles. I don't like flames, open flames. I just don't. Oh, she says, doesn't this smell? Look, 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 she's sticking it in my face. She takes the cap off, sticks it in my face. Oh, isn't this, uh, this is awesome. Isn't this such a great smell? And I, I says, you know, lady, you're going to really hate me for this, but I'm not feeling it. She looked at me like I had three heads and I was green. What are you going to do? Force me to like it? I don't care for it. I says, by the way, will they be coming out with hand sanitizers and all that? She says, yes, 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 they do. They have them now. I says, oh, okay. I says, I'll take one of those. So she winds up bringing me exactly one. I'm already online. I get off the line. I, I, I grab another one. And, you know, ask me how many do I want. I, I took two. So they had the uh, strawberry pound cake. <clears throat> Let me show you. Let me just, I should have brought it out here, but I didn't. Okay. Okay, I'm back. 
you know, no big deal. So I've been using the strawberry pound cake. If you can see that. All right. I know it's backwards. There we go. Strawberry pound cake. Eh. It, to me, it smells like more like a strawberry cheesecake than a pound cake. <laughs> so, and I thought they already had cheesecake. I, I have no idea what the scents are, but I got two of them. And I then noticed because I didn't, I didn't buy five of them for $7. <clears throat> they used to be five for $6. I now see that the price went up on these. They used to be 175. Then they were like, because I looked at my old ones. I have a million of the old ones. They were 175. Now they're up to 195. So be careful with that, people. <laughs> and it's five to seven dollars. I only got two. I wasn't gonna buy five of these suckers. I mean, it's all right. Am I crazy about it? Not really. What are your views on it? What are your views on it? Let me let me know what you think about it. You know, I mean, I have a bazillion of the hand sanitizers. Like I said, they took away my wax melts at Bath and Body, but they do sell them online. Bring them back to the store. That's what I say. Bring them back to the store. I miss those. I like those. They had such a great scent. And maybe I would even try a strawberry pound cake in the wax melt. What I usually do with a candle... I have, um, as a matter of fact, I need a new one, a melon ball scooper. I take a melon ball scooper and I scoop out the candle and I roll them. Or sometimes you can shape them into a square, whatever you want to do. And I put them in the freezer for, for about, <coughs> excuse me. I put them in the freezer for about maybe 15, 20 minutes to get them you know, a hard consistency. Because wax candles are different to melt than regular wax cubes. You know that. It's a different texture. And then I just wax, I, I just melt the wax anyway. I, I do that from the candle. I may actually just buy the candle and just do that and just make my own wax melt out of it. Because the burning candle, I don't like them. I was also considering who here has one of those um, candle warmer lamps. That ain't bad. That I think I would I would consider. I was checking them out on Amazon. I don't see anything that I really like. And the stores does, don't have those. So, well, people, let me know your views on this wax and candle thing and this strawberry pound cake thing. I mean, I'm not jumping up and down for it, but everybody seems to be, you know, it's like it's all the rage now. So just take it slow and let's see. <laughs> My store doesn't have a release date on it yet, but I'm thinking that it's this week, being that they popped out the candle already. So... Take care. Love to all. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for subscribing. I do have a few more subscribers that I see. And um, that's really it. So, have a great day, people. Love to all. Thank you for watching. I'll be back with some more stuff. This is really, like, faded. Okay, I'll be back now with some more stuff, hopefully, in the next, oh, I don't know, a few more days. If anything else pops into my head, we'll see. <laughs> you never know what's in my head. Okay, love to all. Have a great day. Bye-bye.